It's May 5th, 2008. This is the stock car se session on stock car session on the Go Live Stream Network. Well, uh, the Sprint Sprint Cup guys were at Richmond this week weekend, and there was some great racing. Uh, didn't get to watch either one of the races, but uh, Boyer won. Bush was second. Harvick ended up eighth, and Mears ended up thirty sixth in the Sprint Cup race. And uh, Harvick was second in the Bush race. Denny Hamlin was the winner, and uh, I heard that was a really exciting race. And some cars pitted, and some cars didn't. And uh, some people say Harvick should have pitted. Who knows? You know. Uh, I didn't get to see the race, so maybe I'll get to watch it sometime during this week. A.J. Kirkpatrick wins the Western All-Star Race this weekend. Uh, big news, though, was Ed Elliott, who's been on the show before, and uh, he hit the wall at Formosa Raceway in his 56 Chevy doing 155 miles an hour, and the uh, car broke apart, happened Saturday in the morning, and uh, he flipped eight times and uh, walked away from it. He was relatively a little dingy, but uh, walked away. Then went to Bakersfield Speedway, got into Lance Hildebrand's car, and drove it to a third-place finish in the mini-stock race. And he would have been here tonight, but uh, he felt a little, still a little dingy from the wreck and stuff, so... He'll be here next week, and he's got pictures and everything else to, to bring us. So we look forward to Ed uh, being on the show next week. And uh, that that must have been a wild ride for him. Iron Man. Yeah, definitely he's an Iron Man. Dude, I flipped, and I broke every bone in my body. So <laughs> he's uh, he must have been, he came across fine to me, and he looked, looked okay to me too. So uh, great racer. Well, uh... Larry Hood wins the IMCA Modified Race at Bakersfield Speedway, and uh, that was one of the most exciting races I've ever seen at Bakersfield Speedway. So let's take a look at the last few minutes. He was really excited, so check this out. in the two car. Good boy, right there. there's a pass for the lead. Bill and Clark locked horns out of turn two. The 51 car. And there Bill is. is able, and Hood's got the lead now. Last lap. White flag, one more left to go, Hood on the hot side. Comes down low out of turn two. Right People in the left there. car in front. Oh, mama. Slide. And Larry Hood will slide job. Up to the win. Bell second, Mark third, fourth, two, J. Marks, uh, uh, Brian Clark. That's a little wild here. His first win of the season. And he was revved up. And he knows where to park his car, everybody. If you win, that's where I want you to park yeah, the real fast TV. Yeah. <laughs> Boy, he with about two laps to go. I want to thank Terry Henry so much for everything he does for me, my father. Race group, A Furniture Outlet, A1 Multi Business, thank you all for coming out. I hope we on a show for you. Performance Industries, thank you all. Uh, let me tell you what, a slide job coming out of turn four on the bottom. Pretty exciting stuff. You want to throw one of them up there? All right, that's what I'm thinking about. He's going to 
throw some wild child frisbees up there for you guys. Yeah, that was a great race. He put on an awesome race, and uh, Larry Hood, he hadn't been racing out there regularly this year, but uh, came in and stole one from the regulars. So, uh, awesome race. Uh, Reed wins the mini stock race. Mark Reed and uh, Jason Manister won the hobby stock race, which was a great race. They had 31 cars, which is phenomenal. And uh, they... Uh, those guys, they know how to race. They put on a great show. Uh, I'm always excited to see them. The American Stock Race, I'll be streaming after after the show, and uh, we'll have it up on the left side. So uh, we won't tell you who won that, and just watch that one on the on the site. Well, uh, Elizabeth Talby was out there with R Real Fast TV getting some interviews, and here are a couple interviews right here. Hey, this is Elizabeth with Real Fast TV out here with Wayne tonight. How's it going? Oh, not too bad. It's like we got you just before you're going out there to, to pack the, the track down. How's it going? Oh, not too bad. Season's going pretty good so far. Having a lot of fun. That's what how's, it's how's the car running for you? Um, it's been hit and miss, but we're hoping to make it a little better tonight. Yeah. How, uh, how long have you been racing out here at the Speedway? This is my first full year. Okay. I raced a half a year last year. Okay. And just in this class? Just in this class, yeah. So you're, you're enjoying it then, huh? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's a lot of fun. So uh, what can we expect out of you tonight? You think you're going to come in in the top three? I'm going to hope so. Yeah? Yeah, that's what I'm working for. <laughs> well, uh, give me, you got a little time to tell me about your sponsors on your car? Or? Um, yeah, we got uh, A&B Ag, which helps us out a lot. Um, cheap Towing, uh, Tina Marie's Downtown Cafe, and Wolf, uh, Wolf Racing, which is uh, Wolf Construction. That's one of my biggest sponsors. and They help me out a lot and help keep the car on track. Great. Well, good luck out there. I don't want to keep you for too long. I know you got to get out there, but uh, thanks for taking the time with us. Thank you. Thank you for joining us. This is Elizabeth with Real Fast TV. Hey, this is Elizabeth with Real Fast TV. Just taking a time out here to talk with Matt Wonkum tonight. How's it going? Good. Getting ready for uh, running in the track? Yeah, I'll get out there and get it, get it hot lapped and uh, broke in, ready to go. So how's the car been running for you so far this season? I haven't had any real good luck. Yeah? Yeah. Uh, Blew the motor the first race of the season, and we're off two weeks. Made it a couple weeks, and got hit in the main event three laps in last week. So, ho hopefully things will turn around for us. You got the car back in working condition though for tonight's race. Yeah, hope so. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, tell me a little bit about your sponsors here, Matt. Uh, Peterson Auto Supply, CarQuest out in Wasco, okay. and uh, Ultra Clear Pools. Uh, they both help me out week to week, and and they make it possible. Without the two of them, we couldn't do it. Yeah, we got a great looking car and uh, we look forward to seeing you out there on the track. Good luck tonight. Well, thank you. We need it. Thanks for joining us, Matt. And thank you for joining us. This is Elizabeth with Real Fast TV. Yeah, there was some great racing out there this weekend and uh, we're looking forward. Uh, we're going we're gonna to be streaming the American Stocks after the show. This is going to be a short show. Uh, Vukovic Classic at Madeira this weekend. Big race up there. If you want to go see some asphalt, it's a good time to see some asphalt up there. We're going to be here at Bakersfield Speedway. We have 360 sprints, dwarf cars, mini dwarfs, and mini stocks. And it's free Pepsi night out there, so uh, if you get a chance, uh, get on out there. It's going to be a great show out there. And uh, this is Jeff Tilsher for RealFast.tv your racing channel.